A typhoon Namadol is pummeling Japan with ferocious winds and record rainfall. It has caused the death of at least two people and injured more than a hundred. Nearly six million people are still under evacuation warnings. All this even though it has weakened since making landfall. CNA's Michio Ishida reports from Tokyo. Shibuya in Tokyo is crowded despite the erratic weather. Protest for his former Prime Minister Shinzo Abe's funeral has gone ahead as planned. Typhoon Namodo is so huge, it's been dumping heavy rain and on and off in the capital since Sunday. It's earlier slashed through Kyushu, the southernmost main Japanese island. Japan Meteorological Agency issued a special warning or the highest of five stages towards natural disasters. This warning was created following the devastating tsunami of 2011 in northeast Japan, which killed over 18,000. There are reports of numerous buildings damaged with some crushed, including a national cultural asset in Miyazaki and landslides. Rivers were reported overflowing. A man in his 60s was discovered and his car dead. He was on his way to evacuation shelter. To avoid the worst case scenario, stored water was released from over 100 dams throughout Japan ahead of time to prevent them from overflowing and causing extensive damage. Public transportations are impacted. Around 1,000 flights have been canceled and bullet trains suspended. Prime Minister Kishida decided to postpone his trip to the UN General Assembly by one day. Michio Ishida, CNA, Tokyo.